Merry Vlogmas! Welcome to day six. I uh, hope you are all having slash have had a lovely weekend. Um, we are going to nip to B&Q today um, to have a look at their Christmas things. Also, we need a couple of bits for the garden. Uh, so we thought we'd take you along for that. Very excited, I know, B&Q. Um, someone is very festive today. Wearing their new Christmas tree dress. Look, she knows. Say Merry Christmas. Woohoo. Okay, what number are you looking for for your advent today, uh, Isabel? Six. Six. Oh, good yeah. job. Uh. Oh. So that. Is called um, shuffle and squelch and other rhymes. Hmm, that's a new one, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Do you think it's a songbook? Oh, it is. We could learn these songs, couldn't we? They're brand new songs. Do you like it? Yeah. Yeah. Madison, what are you doing? Are you in a box? Yeah? Have you thrown your pyjamas around? Yeah. So in other news, I just love that they still do um, rubbish jokes on the back of penguins. Um, this joke I remember reading and not getting when I was about six years old. And they're still knocking out the same jokes as well. What's a penguin's favourite ice cream flavour, guys? Pistachio. Not as easy to say as it doesn't sound. One's your favourite, is it Isabel? Why is that one your favourite? Because I like yellow. Pardon? Because I like yellow. Because you like yellow. Oh, the yellow lights. Oh, that's yeah. nice. What's your favourite tree, um, Alfie? This one, that one? It has like the snow and like the, like the pine cones and berries. Yeah, it's lovely, isn't it? Riley, what's your favourite one? Uh, my favourite's probably that one as well. This one? Yeah. Why is that one your favourite? Um, Yeah. He is a biggie, isn't he? And yeah. they've got 20% off all their Christmas stuff today, haven't they? Oh. It only has one bulbul on it. No, it's got two. Look. Look at these ones. I like those. Oh, is that what we've got? No, I think that one is. It's not the right flavour, but it's the same thing that we bought, isn't it? Which one's your favourite one? Do you want to show me? Where's the penguin? There it is. So we're just on the lookout for Daddy and Madison and Nana. But we don't know where they are, do we guys? No. No, can't find them. <laughs> Hunting around being cute. Oh, it's the aircon. Singing on this Christmas night. They are singing for you and me. 
Right, we found our little Christmas tree for outside the door. Ta-da, they're all a little bit wonky, but he's the best one for sure. We're gonna pull up that hydrangea, aren't we? And then... I don't know what they're called. Plant this one. <laughs> Pull up the dead one and put yeah, that only, in. Only ten pounds as well, isn't it? And there's twenty percent off all Christmas stuff as well oh, at the yeah. minute, isn't there? Need to find some, some lights for it now. Yeah. This is what the elf got up to in the night. Opened the new drive sweets, sweets everywhere, and he's got his head right in the tub. The boys are not impressed with this at all. Adam's got some more festive treats to add to our collection. I've never seen these before. These are Jingly Bells, which says it is milk chocolate with hazelnut paste. Yummy. Yummy. Yeah. So this is a new plant that we got from B&Q. Um, how much was he, Adam? £4? Four pounds. £4, yeah. Four pounds. Just and something to fill in the Yeah, it looks right. lovely now. Very festive. And this is our £10 Christmas tree. He's so beautiful. We love him. Um, and we've got some lights, some battery lights with a timer on that we're going to put on later. So apart from our lovely Christmas tree and plant, we didn't get too much else from being cute, but I will show you what we did get. So we decided to try a doorbell for the first time. Um, for £2, it was rude not to really, and it's just, it's a stick-on one, so it, it there's foam pads to, to stick onto the wood around the door, so that there's no drilling or anything. Um, so we're going to give them a go and see what they're like, um, just because they're £2 really. Um, we also got these lights, so these are 50 um, lights, and they were £4, but then obviously they had 20% off. Um, they're battery operated, and there's a timer, which is... Fabulous. Um, we're going to put them around the new Christmas tree. Um, so we'll probably put that in tomorrow's vlog um, to show you what they look like. Very excited about that. And we got these for the boys because Riley's favourite colour is red and Alfie's is blue. And they love that there's fake snow in them. And they were £2 and then obviously with the 20% off. Um, Isabel, I got let Isabel have her penguin that she really wanted, but um, she's looking after that, so I can't film that at the minute. <laughs> I'll try and prize it away from her to show you. So I thought I'd show you a few other Christmassy bits that I bought the last few days. Um, this is a make your own felt um, nativity bunting thing. It says craft. Oh, I thought it said craft kids. <laughs> I was gonna, just about to say that feels silly thinking it's hard but it says kit not kid so yeah it's hard um so it comes with step-by-step -step instructions which do look quite straightforward which is good um it comes with all the little um people all the felt things um ready ready cut the baby jesus um it comes with a little sewing set and like the bunting ribbon and things and it comes with the the filling and you've basically just got to sew everything together to make this. It looks really cute. If I'm honest, I didn't realise it was sewing, but I'm going to give it a go because I don't really do too many crafty things. So um, I'm looking forward to giving this a go um, and I'll let you know how it goes. <laughs> we also got these from the garden centre. Um, Adam is super excited about using this this Christmas. Um, it's a, a, something to wrap, not to wrap, to cut the wrapping paper with. Um, it looks quite cool. I think you, I think the idea is you just put it on the on the roll and whoosh, this looks like it's a, like a, a blade. That was um, three ninety nine from our local garden centre too. Um, Adam is so excited. Um, and we also got this from the garden centre. Um, one of these projectors. We've we've bowed down to the pressure from the children and got one because we got a voucher for half price for it so it's really not too really um i think we're going to try and put it in the back garden um to project it up on the fence or maybe on the patio i'm not sure um but the children are very excited for this to go up so we'll show you what it's like when it's up and we've also had something delivered to us so this was made by mark your moments by busy izzy's 
um, search for them on Facebook and Instagram. So I follow them on both of those. And it is a Christmas Eve plate thing. It's the same kind of material as like a worktop saver in the kitchen. Um, and I just love it. I think it's so beautiful. And I love that it's personalised. I think the, the colours and the all the pictures, they're so lovely. Um, previous years we've got like plastic plates from like home bargains of B&M and they're, they're very lovely but they don't seem to last so um, I'm really excited for this I think this is going to be something that's going to last us years like as the girls get older um, yeah we really love it and we can't wait to use it on Christmas Eve so we've had another lovely vlogmas day um, we're really enjoying um, doing this vlogmas for the first time. Um, yeah, we're finding it really enjoyable. Um, we hope you are too. Um, as I said a few days ago, if you have any ideas for us, then please pop them in the comments or message me on Instagram. Um, we'd love to hear them. Um, I feel a bit sad that the charade thing has ended, really. Um, but yeah, no one would do it with me. Ooh. Um... So yeah, and I found it really difficult to find, uh, think of any um, that you could do through video. So yeah, I'm sorry about that. Um, thank you so much for watching. Um, we hope you've enjoyed it and we will see you tomorrow for day seven. Seven already? <gasps> Thanks for watching. Bye bye.